Hey guys, so I'm feeling very happy and festive today and it's time for a haul video, so if you want to see it, then keep on watching. I'm going to start with two Christmas jumpers that I got and one is from New Look and first time I saw this, I saw this actually online and it is from the kids section. So the other day I went shopping and I found it and I fell in love with it. It's just as beautiful as it looks online and it is this. It is this beautiful pug Christmas jumper, like a white jumper with little pugs and it says on it pugs and kisses with this beautiful sparkly red writing and it's just gorgeous, it's a cropped jumper, I mean probably not meant to be cropped but it is on me because it's from the kids section. This one is actually for 12 to 13 year olds which is crazy but I tried the one for 15 to 16 year olds and first of all it was really massive and oversized on me because even this one is oversized, that meant to be oversized so also it wasn't cropped, I just wanted something cropped but this one actually fits perfectly and it's beautiful and I can't wait to wear it, I mean it's not the warmest and the thickest of your Christmas jumpers however underneath it has fleece, it actually does keep you quite warm with a fleece, this was 12 .99, so 13 pounds and then the second place where I got my Christmas jumper from was Asda and the only reason why I went to Asda was to pick up a Christmas jumper because again I saw online that they had really beautiful ones although when I went there it was quite late in the evening they didn't have many sizes left or many styles left but this one I fell in love with, I mean they had a few this style ones, very thick and very festive and kind of tacky but in a way I wanted something more sophisticated and I thought this one was I honestly you guys think this is beautiful, this is a Christmas tree jumper as you can see and I think it's gorgeous, it's just plain off white at the back but on the front it has many of these beautiful Christmas trees and I don't know if my camera will pick them up as beautifully as they look in real life but they have a green sparkly thread going through them, also red decorations and a star on top and they even have a spare star here just in case you lose one but I think they're quite steady so I hope I won't lose any and this is again not the thickest of your jumpers but I think that's what makes it more wearable. This was actually one of the more expensive Christmas jumpers that Asda had. This was £16. It's not a lot compared to other places. Places like Next for example, some of the Christmas jumpers retail for like £35. So £16 is not a lot, it's not a lot at all. But if you are looking for affordable Christmas jumpers then Asda is the place to go to because they even had some for £12 and for 14 pounds and sticking with the Christmas theme this next thing is from Next and although it's probably the least practical thing in this entire haul it's also the one that makes me the happiest it is hands down my favorite thing from this entire haul which is crazy but I love it so much it is this reindeer hat ah uh, you guys I just love this, I don't care what anyone says about this, I think it's beautiful, I love that big chunky, very festive sparkly red pompon, love the eyes, the horns, the ears, love the color, love everything about it, this is very thick and warm, it has a fleece on the inside just like the jumper but it's actually really warm, I'm always very cold and I think this would be perfect outside and this is how it looks on, I'm kind of out of shot but I just want to show you this and yeah I just think it's beautiful at the moment I can't really show you properly how it looks but I will definitely be uploading pictures of me wearing this on my Instagram I can't wait to wear this hat you guys it was 14 pounds which is quite pricey for a Christmas hat but the quality of it is amazing and it also makes me happy and since I'm talking about next I'm just going to show you two stocking fillers that I got for my nan and my granddad from next and comes in this festive next bag and I found these two sets that they had in their Christmas range I mean they had more than these two but these two were my favorite fragrance wise the set for my nan is the just pink set it comes with a body lotion and perfume don't know if you can see because it's white but the packaging is really nice and pink and has some little polka dots it was only 12 pounds and the set for my granddad is called midnight again comes with a body lotion 
and a perfume and I actually love the packaging of this one it's beautiful sparkly festive it has a little black bow I will come back to stocking fillers in a minute but firstly I want to mention a few things that I got for myself on Black Friday sale and I wanted a faux fur coat for quite some time either white or off-white cream color and then I went to Topshop during Black Friday sale and the coat that I was actually looking for was half off I was so happy and I got it and it looks like this you guys I know not everyone will like this and it's quite hard to show you anyway but for instance my mom doesn't really like this coat but I love it I've been looking for something similar for ages and I finally got it it was reduced from 90 pounds to 45 pounds I know coming January and February it will get much colder so something like this is essential when I put it on when I tried it on in Topshop I instantly felt very warm and snuggly and basically like I was wrapped in a blanket or something which is incredible and then I went to Debenhams because they had 10% off across all of their cosmetics for Black Friday sale but to be fair I got quite overwhelmed by the amount of things that they had and that everything was on offer and also because of Black Friday I wanted to pick up some other bigger presents for my for my family for Christmas I didn't want to spend that much money on myself so I only ended up picking one thing but it is Urban Decay All Night Makeup Setting Spray Long Lasting Oil Free Paraben Free and Temperature Control Technology and it's a 30 ml bottle which I think is a quite a good size I know they have a one that's 110 ml or something it is basically a makeup finishing spray that you spray after you put on your makeup to make it last and on day-to-day -day basis I don't really have a problem with my makeup not lasting so I didn't really want it to pick up a bigger size because I'm not going to be using this every day but on holiday I have a problem with my makeup staying because of the heat the humidity my makeup just kind of melts off my face and then lastly for myself on Black Friday sale I picked up a few skincare items from number seven I love number seven skincare. I think the skincare is quite more on the high end side, which you can kind of see with the prices, but also with the ingredients. And two of these products were on sale for Black Friday, and one of them was just at a regular price. My first thing is this youthful replenishing facial oil, all skin types, and basically it was 11 pounds reduced from 22 pounds. And I and they had a little test and I put it on my hand and I kind of fell in love with it If this won't irritate my skin or it won't clog my pores I'm pretty sure I will love it just because I love oils in general and the second thing is also kind of a skincare item But only kind of I mean it was in the skincare section But it is the instant illusions airbrush away primer So this is basically like a makeup primer makeup base or you can wear it without any makeup I suppose but I don't know if it actually has any skincare benefits to it or whether you just use standard primer that will just minimize the appearance of pores and fine lines again they had a test that I swatched it it really reminded me of Benefit Pore Professional which is my all-time favorite primer it was also on sale for Black Friday it wasn't half off though I think it was something like 30% off and then my third thing was not on offer but it wasn't very expensive to begin with so I decided to pick it up anyway and this this number seven essential moisture night cream nourishes and replenishes while you sleep this is one of the most affordable night creams for dry skin that they have this was only nine pounds fifty I thought it would be good to try out again they had a test that it felt very thick and moisturizing bear in mind I love my protect and perfect intense advanced night cream from number seven I love that stuff but I think it retails for 23 pounds 50 or something so I want to kind of see whether it compares at all or not moving on to some random purchases I mean I've got another thing from number seven but this one wasn't bought on the same shopping trip it was bought before and this one I've actually tried out already and it is number seven protect and perfect intense advanced serum I love this the whole line I think of number seven protect and perfect intense advanced skincare which is a mouthful but there you go it's amazing I especially love this underneath my eyes it has a very kind of 
silicone texture which kind of threw me off at first I wasn't very sure if I was going to love it because it almost felt like my primer but actually it is very moisturizing if you have dry patches underneath your eyes this is a product to go for it is quite pricey just like this whole range from number seven but in my opinion it's worth it i also have two makeup items and first one is from anastasia although i want to say anastasia because i like the sound of anastasia a lot more than anastasia but then the company has been correcting every youtuber saying it's anastasia i've seen lots of people raving about this product on youtube so i really wanted to try it out and i love it it's called deep brow pomade and mine is in the shade urban and first of all i love the packaging i love the little symbol here it says anastasia on it and then you open it up and you have kind of this moussey thing as you can see i've tried it out like three times already and i really do like it i use it with a very teeny tiny precise angled brush it's not the product that i have on my eyebrows right now but it's definitely has become one of my favorite products to put on my eyebrows and then my second product is again something that i wanted to try out for quite a while and it is the bourgeois bronzing primer well it's not really a primer in my opinion in my opinion just a cream bronzer and i've tried this one already as well and I love this you guys, this is fantastic. This honestly has become my favorite makeup product from Bourjois that I've ever tried. It's really, really lovely. It smells similar to the chocolate bronzer, but the smell is even more intense. It's beautiful and you can still smell it when you apply it on your face. So I love that about it. I love the color, I love the consistency. I love the pigmentation. I love how nicely it applies, how nicely it blends, how non patchy it is. So lastly, I'm just going to show you a few more stocking fillers. As I said, I won't be showing you bigger main presents, but if you are stuck for any small gift ideas, then firstly have this Adele 25. I will be giving this away to my nan, but she actually specifically asked for this CD. She actually said she wanted it and she was looking to buy it so i said i'll just get her one for christmas i just ordered mine off of amazon then i also went to tk maxx and to be fair i wasn't very impressed with their christmas gifts that they had i mean not many stand out to me so i only picked up one thing but this one i actually quite liked and it is this bathing house I thought it looked really nice and festive. This is for my nan and some of you may remember last year I picked up a similar house from NYX but it was a baking house not a bathing house but this time I picked up the one from Beautycology from TK Maxx and it comes with what does it come with it comes with a body wash shower cream and two body butters so here you go two body butters and then one shower cream and one shower gel and just the whole idea i think it's really cute and festive and then lastly i have a few things from tesco and firstly i have this this is from Bailey's and Harding, England, limited edition evening clutch bag. And this is for my nan on my dad's side. It looks really nice and festive, has a little bow. I also got this cranberry collection, real extracts. So like a shower cream, a body butter, a lip balm, a body lotion. And then for my granddad, I have this Duff Men and Care total care body and face wash anti perspirant post shave balm and of course this little bag which i know he actually likes them bags and he'll make a use of it so that's why i got it because i know he actually likes to carry his things in kind of bags like this and on the similar line i got two of these as well okay guys so that is the end for this whole video Thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed. If you didn't, please like it and subscribe to me if you're not already. And I'll see my next one. Bye!